लर्निंग इक्वल हाफ्स पार्ट थ्री टूडे वी विल लर्न थिंग्स कैन बी डिवाइडेड इन टू हाफ इन अ नंबर ऑफ वेज हेलो मैडम हेलो वंदना एंड आयुष्मान टूडे आई हैव गॉट चॉकलेट्स फॉर बोथ ऑफ यू ही आर यू गो थैंक यू मैडम एंड फॉर मी I have got only one chocolate for both of you. You both divide this chocolate into half. Okay madam, thank you. I will divide this chocolate into half. In how many ways can you divide this chocolate into halves? This chocolate has 6 pieces. This is one way I can divide it into two equal parts. I will break this from the middle. Like this there will be two equal parts. Is there any other way to divide this chocolate in half? Look, Vandana, we can divide this into two equal parts like this. By using this way to divide in two parts, we still have three pieces each. I did not think that we can divide into two equal parts using this way. Then it can also be divided into two equal parts like this. Absolutely right, Vandana. This means that the same thing can be divided into halves in many ways. Yes, look at this paper. It is a rectangular paper and it can also be cut into halves in many ways. You also try to divide it into halves in many ways. This paper can be divided into equal halves in this way. You have divided it into two halves in quite a few ways. Yet there are many more ways by which it can be divided into halves. What are the other ways by which it can be divided into halves? Look, this is also another way. Oh yes, this can be divided into half like this too. We didn't think of this. Similarly, there are more ways in which they can be divided into halves. I have understood. This means the paper is measured based on its area so we can divide it into half in any way we just have to take care that the two parts are of the same area absolutely right vandana today you learned there can be several ways to divide objects into halves depending on its area Like Vandana and Ayushman divided the paper into two halves in different ways. Thank you.